Outpost is most impressive. It's small but strongly built. It can withstand just about any assault. Hello, Princess of Arles. It's been too long. Uncle Gio, what are you doing here? I came to see how your work has been going, and your training. You've come a long way. You should have told me you were coming to visit. Is it really okay for a king like you to just go wandering around? Hmm, a valid point. But my kingship is in the past now. Arland has become a republic, you know. I have many skilled subordinates. So even in my absence, the government will always run smooth. But how about you? I heard you've taken the lead on the plan to develop your kingdom. It's just like you said. I was able to come this far because I have lots of great people supporting me. I see. So we're more alike than I'd imagined. Yeah, maybe. But who is this with you? I feel like we've met before, but... Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't introduced myself. My name is Esther Dean. I'm here to observe Arles on behalf of Arland. be directing all general business related to the development and settlement of Arl's kingdom. But really, my main job is simply to look after our wandering lord here. Hey, come on, that's not very nice. I'm just fulfilling my duties the only way I know how. Well, let's leave it at that. If you two will excuse me, I'll talk with you again, Princess Merirule. Miss Esty, please, call me Merirule. Like my Uncle Gio here? I really don't like formality. Mm hmm Thank you. Okay then, Maruru. We'll speak again when we both have a little more free time. So how long will you be in Arles, Uncle? I've been stuck behind a desk so long, I'm completely out of shape. I'll stay here until I feel I'm back on track. You never change. Anyway, Father's been concerned about you too. <laughs> I know, I know. I'll pay him a visit once I get to town. It'll be nice to reminisce about the good old times. I can imagine. Oh, and come visit my workshop when you arrive, too. Promise me? <laughs> <laughs> 